Now, arranging a funeral can come with the additional stress of an unexpectedly large bill of over £4,000 on average, according to a recent survey. The industry is at the centre of a probe from the Competition and Markets Authority after it found that the cost of a funeral had been rising by double the rate of inflation for over a decade and that customers could be disadvantaged by a lack of competition and transparency over costs when they might be at their most vulnerable. Now, a company called Farewell is trying to disrupt the market with cremations without the funeral. Dan Garrett is the chief executive and co-founder of Farewell. He's with me in the studio. Good morning. Good morning. Also on the line is David Collingwood, who's director of funerals for Co-op Funeral Care, which organises around 100,000 funerals per year. Good morning to you, David. Good morning. Uh, Dan, let's start off with you, because basic cremations are already on offer. We know, for example, that Debbie Bay opted for that particular option. Um, so what are you offering that's different to what's on the market at the moment? Well. We actually started a few years ago and we started in the will side of things. So, mm. so we launched a sort of nationwide will writing um, online website. And within about 18 months, we were the biggest in the UK. And the fascinating thing about it was that you get to see sort of inside the will, the type of funerals that people want. And you would have these moving, romantic uh, ideas for funerals that were so different to what you saw when you actually go to the local high street. So there's this huge departure from the traditional type of sombre, top hat wearing, tailcoat flouting uh, Victoriana. And what we realised was that about 90% of people in the UK don't want what would typically be seen as a traditional funeral.